Sziasztok, üdvözlök mindenkit! Folytassuk a vicsert, már pedig, mégpedig a harmadik részt. Tudom, azt ígértem, hogy meg befejezzük a Farewell of the White Wolf modot. Be is fogjuk, csak nem ma, mert ma nem igazán van hozzá kedvem. Mármint, hogy kicsit több akcióra vágyom, már bocsánat, hogy így fogalmazok. De mindegy, a lényeg a lényeg, hogy lassan elkezdenénk befejezni a, a sztorit a harmadik résznek a második DLC-vel, tehát a Blood and Wine-nal. Sziasztok srácok, para, Markboy, hello hello. Szóval befejeznénk most már a DLC-t, hát nem ma, én be én biztos vagyok, tehát kizárt, hogy ma be tudjuk fejezni. De legalább elkezdenénk a, az endgame-et. Úgyhogy, úgyhogy ez lesz ma. Igen, para iszok. Csak gondoltam, felkonferálom magamat. Kérted, hogy igyak? Iszok. Ó, oh, Márkból is kéri. Ebből bioszünet lesz, akárki meglássa. Jó. Na, úgyhogy elvileg itt is vagyunk Geráltal. Egy korcs volt. Na jó. Így most már kettő. Jó. Na. Szóval itt vagyunk Geráltal. Ha minden igaz. És ugye... Hát itthonról indulunk. Mindenféle buffal. Bár itt az elején még rohadtul nem fog kelleni, de legyen. És onnan folytatjuk, hogy um, hát ott hagytuk abba a fő sztori szállat, hogy ugye Regis megőrült, um, de mindegy igazából. Innen kell folytatnunk, hogy megyünk -e ez a cipőpucoló kisgyerekhez. Aki valahol erre van. Mert most éjszaka van, Gerált? Jó, hát akkor leülünk ide a lépcsőre. Legyen 9 óra. Ottan vannak. So how would you explain it? Whether it pours for a week or the sun bakes our pates, we've always mud up to our ankles here. You can't blame me for Beauclair's fickle weather. Fickle weather? I've seen you. You empty your chamber pot in front of our shop each morning, so folks will dirty their boots, go to you to get them cleaned. A far-fetched conspiracy theory, sirs. I'll conspire to welt your bum with my belt. Come here. Leave him alone. Hmm. Just who the spit are you? A witcher, and I'd advise you to go back where you came from. I thought witches defend men from monsters, not cheats from justice. Need to talk to the boy. You can chat to him all you like, after we tan his hide. So stand down. Not gonna happen. Won't it? Well, then we'll thrash you as well. Ah, oh, bunyos nikel. Három ellen. Given no choice. Jó kezdjük. Mi tör? Shit. Pedig közel voltunk. What's the meaning of this? The brawl. Who started it? I'm investigating the beast on the Duchess's orders. Ah, yes. We've heard of you. And these men. What are they doing? Na mi van? Hát hogy ne, hogy nem ártanánk be őket. Obstructing my investigation. Understood. Right. A few days in the clink ought to teach them not to impede official Dutchy business. Hát igen, így mennyi is kemény vagyok. <laughs> Come on. Sorry. 
You're very good with your fists, sir. Wouldn't be looking for work, would you? We'd make a fine duel. Gerard, mit csinál? Látjátok ti is? Na jó, mindegy. Listen, I'm interested in a certain gentleman. Wait, wait! Before we get to talking, please, take a seat. But my boots are clean. In this city, no boots are clean unless they just come off my stamped. A seat, sir, please. Yo, so then, who was it you wanted to ask about? One of your patrons. Tall, elegant black frock. Not from around here. An arrival? Hmm, indeed. I hear a faint bell ringing. A modest sum might make it sing out loud and clear. How much? Let's say... 500 crowns. What's he again? Gotta be kidding me. What would you even do with that kind of coin? Expand my venture. I'm sure you can imagine. Have a proper stand with a big sign. I want a new box too. New polishes, new brushes. And if I've enough coin left, I'll buy a share in a launderer's. Get waste water for free. Hmm. Got it all planned out. I should think Defected. so. Capital is all I require. All right. Let's see if we can't figure something out. Hmm. It's not quite... I don't know... Hmm. It's not quite... I don't know... Le akartam ötvenet. Guess I can agree to that. A thousand thanks. I shan't forget it. Now to the matter at hand. I know the fellow you seek, though I don't know his name. A steady patron gets his boots cleaned every few days. He's very good to me. Always pays me a premium. Know where I might find him? No, but you could wait here. Perhaps he'll stop by. Mm. Don't have the time for that. Sure you don't know where to find him? Or maybe notice which direction he came from? When I clean boots, sir, I do not look up to see where folk come from. I clean. Mm. It seems you're having a rough go of it. Oh. Oh, you're here. Feeling better? I am, thank you. The local necropolis. The air does wonders for them. Now, if I might intercede, I dare say I've the right question to ask. <laughs> you see this vial? Hát igen, para. One drop added to your boot polish will help you wipe even the most encrusted boot clean as the dome of Saint Lebioda's Cathedral. With it, you will serve three times as many patrons at a fraction of the effort and piles more coins. Jó kollégák, ez elmúlt. Újszorát azzal töltöttük, hogy ilyen side questeket csináltunk, meg lootoltunk, meg ilyes. Nem érre. Úszóra in-game time, tehát a, a abszolút time, in-game time-ben ilyen hetek. Yet we had a falling out of sorts and would like to straighten matters out. I leave his boots at the door of a house near the port. The door is red. But I do not know if the gentleman lives there. Worth checking. Might happen on a lead. Would you let me scrape the dirt off your kickers before you go? With all due respect, sirs, your boots could stand a cleaning. Thank you. Perhaps later. Okay. Nincs életünk. Életünk sincs. That's the trick to dealing with children. Yeah, saw that. Meaning the right thing to bribe them with. Red door. One the boot black mentioned. 
Fogadjunk zárva van. You might just as well stand out in the street, pound on a drum and holler, Detlaf, I'm coming for you. A bit more finesse, I implore you. Let's hear your idea. Give me a moment. What is going on? Nice. Ever consider becoming a burglar? A skill like that would come in awful handy. I considered it briefly, but ultimately concluded it would be terribly dull. Come. Nem is tudom, melyik játékban volt ilyen csalás, hogy át lehetett menni a falakon. Régen ilyen... Hát, nem biztos, hogy kvég, de... Talán valami ilyesmi. Meg volt ez a játék, a Blood, azt hiszem. Nagyon hentelős. Lehet, nem is Blood volt a neve. Sense him. No, he's not here. But he was here recently. His scent is still strong. Let's look around. Hot dog. Old toy. No use to anyone. Shame. Must have brought someone joy sometime. Menjünk fel, biztos fönt lesz valami. Let's go. Jó. So this is his nest. Need to look around. Hmm. Somebody fixed this recently. A hölgy az kicsoda? Woman's likeness. Bit smudged. Is his lover? I don't rightly know. Reminds me of someone. Who? Not sure. Can't help feeling I've seen that face before, though. Tools were used recently. Detlaf unwind by fixing toys between murders. Really, no, Geralt, must you? Nice tune. Indeed. I'm not certain why, but it reminds me of home. Our true home from before the conjunction of spheres. Mm-hmm. What about my papir? Levelek. Look, slips of paper, name on each. Count Crespi, Count Duac, Milton de Peyrac Peyron, Count de la Croix. Detlaf's victims, one and all, but that's not his hand. All of it written using the same ink. See the color? Ink was dyed with cinnabarite, rare mineral. Pretty much found only in Nazaire, but I fear it means very little. Anyone could have imported such ink. Fair enough. Still worth remembering. This slip is stained with wine. Not much to go on either, especially not in Beauclair. Perhaps. Yet perhaps also worth remembering. Mm-hmm. Ah, does he mean need to see it? Nothing basically. Need to look around some more. Let's get to work. Under Eretain, you do not know us, but we know you to be a vampire. We know also of your weakness for the wench they call Renawed. Now you know this. We shall chain her down and let rats feed on her. We shall flay the skin from her flesh. Yet you can save her. You need but travel to Beauclair, where you shall slay five men in the manner we prescribe. You must complete the killing in three days. Fail, and the next letter you receive will contain a memento of your failure. Your beloved's finger. As Uya. There you have it. Proof positive Detlaf killed not of his own accord. A blackmailer sunk his claws into him. That that's saying to make Jarotek. 
Any idea what it could be? Hát hát a nyomok szerint. Indeed. Detlaf gains foes occasionally, but they never live long. One might have managed to evade him. Possible in theory, but I know of none. It would have to be someone devilishly dangerous. As you well know, having faced Detlaf yourself, whoever it is, it is someone new. Who's Renawed? His one-time lover. The sole human woman with whom he was very close. Because she accepted him. With her aid and care, he found a place for himself in this hostile world. She began the work that I strive to continue. Ever meet her? Never had the pleasure, alas. She deserted him a time before he came round to save me. Though he always claimed she'd gone missing. Why do you think that? Any signs or clues to that effect? None to be found. Apparently she disappeared one day. Her belongings disappeared with her. Not a scenario one associates with kidnapping. In my humble opinion, she left on her own. Scared off, perhaps, by a bout of Detlaf's rage that revealed his other, more monstrous side. Detlaf have trouble letting go, accepting that she'd left him? Is that so hard to believe? Do you know no humans who've struggled with just such a thing? And Detlaf is so much more emotional than most humans. Not only was she his beloved, his lover, his mate, she was a member of his pack. And one never leaves one's pack voluntarily. Mm. Did Detlaf ever try to find her? I mean, if she was that important, higher vampires have their ways, all kinds. Should have been easy as pie for him. Geralt, as you rightly noted, we are vampires, not miracle workers. He searched. For months on end before giving up. Clearly Renoued knew him all too well. Enough to cover her tracks. Leave no way for him to find her. Even if Renoued did abandon him that time, looks like someone's actually kidnapped her this time. Hard to argue with that. And hard to foresee what he's prepared to do to free her. Get her back. He's prepared to kill, that's clear. As would you be for Yennefer. He kills, for he cares for her deeply. And that blood, those individuals, they mean nothing to him. Yeah, I get it now. He's out to rescue a female from his pack. Exactly. Blackmailer. Kinda curious who it could be. Why is that? Regis. Somebody kidnapped a vampire's lover. Bold to begin with. Now they're forcing the vampire to kill. A vampire you yourself insisted no murderer. Blackmailer's skilled. Someone special. Hmm. Astute. Now that I think of it, I'm beginning to wonder if... It's not one of your kind? Another vampire? Precisely. The plot thickens. Just a hypothesis. Wouldn't set my heart on it till we know more. Right you are. Let's sum up what we know. Seems Deadlaugh's being blackmailed. Someone's been feeding him his victims' names. All noted down using one and the same Nazari ink, and not in his handwriting. Not much. But enough to ascertain Detlaf's innocence, clearly. Had the... Had the early Meg. Not how I'd put it. Doubt it's how the Duchess will see it either. I trust you to convince her. Then... What? Go on, don't be shy. See, you've got it all figured out, including the grin I gotta wear. It's a rather bold plan, but... Were we to find Renoued, we would strip the blackmailers of their hold on Detlaf. That's one idea. Hmm. Could be worth a shot. But what about Detlaf? You gonna go on killing while I'm out searching for his lover? He will not. I shall convince him to stay his hand. Assure him you're a friend seeking to help. I'll await him here. He's sure to return sooner or later. Think he'll listen? He will. I'll await with you, maybe. No, he'll sense you from a mile off. Simply fail to appear. I'd better stay alone. You must trust me on this. Fine. Need to report to the Duchess first. So be it. We'll await you here. Detlaf and I both. Hát igen, ez most ilyen érdekes dolog, mert most akkor ártatlan vagy sem? Hát nyilván ő követi a...
Nyilván ő követi el a gyilkosságokat. Na jó, jelen, jelentsünk a Dashesnek, hogy mi a helyzet. Az meg nyilván a palotában van, mert hát hol lenne. Geralt of Rivia, Master Witcher. I was not mistaken. You arrived and trouble followed soon after. Me. Step aside. Got a matter for the Duchess. At last, Witcher. We've been on tenterhooks. Did you catch Milton's killer? Yeah, I am a meat on my card. Case is more serious than we thought. The beast? I couldn't kill it. Didn't manage. We sent you after a monster and you return with nothing? We are very disappointed. You won hat. Situation's not quite that simple. Beast's a powerful vampire. Ha. Is this a problem? Is it too much for a witcher? A no, 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 no. But everyone knows how to end a vampire. Draw him by trick into sunlight. Or arm yourself with ample garlic and drive a stake through its heart. Garlic's useless <sighs> against vampires. Sun and stakes don't hurt him either. Those methods, pure invention. Only work in legends and fables. And Buckthorn? When I was a child, Grandmama Ademarta always claimed Buckthorn drives off vampires. Silver sword's your best option for keeping them at bay. But it won't get the job done, because only a higher vampire can truly kill another of its kind. Excuses. Ha! Your grace, I shall assemble a batu. Bring the matter to its end at once. The witcher need but tell us where to find this monster. Whoa, this is work for a witcher, not for your guardsmen. Yet when a witcher fails, my guardsmen must step in. I'll take my best. Forty hardened veterans. No vampire can stand up to that. Forty, fifty, a hundred? Doesn't matter. Won't make any difference against him. You have not seen my guardsmen in action. Can they fight fog? Hit a target that moves faster than the wind? How? What creature can do such things? Creatures like this one. Higher vampires, we call them. Each one's a little different. Unique or exceptional, you might say. Some transform into giant bats. Others communicate with animals, command them. Yet all are still brainless beasts. Mm -hmm. Dead wrong. Thinking of lesser vampires. Alps, Ekamaras, Catacans, for instance. They're ruled by instinct, sure. Attack anything that smells of blood. Higher vampires? They think. They employ reason. Monsters driven by reason. A curious contention. What then do you intend to do? It's way beyond being some monster. This is a powerful being that's walked the world for centuries. Yeah, impossible. If so great is their power, why have they not killed or enslaved us all? Don't usually meddle in our matters. Mostly stay out of our way because they don't care about humans one way or the other. And they do not fear we shall wipe them out one day. <laughs> They'd probably be pretty amused if you asked them that. They're well aware of their strength. Then what can we do? Do you have a plan? Hát igen, a vámpirok kemények. Ez a könyvbe is van, hogy tehát Gerált is mondja a könyvbe, hogy esélye nem lenne egy ilyen higher vampire ellen. Try to talk to him. That's our best bet. I cannot believe this. És mivel most én játszok, ezért ez könnyen valósággá is válhat. Instead, he wishes to chat with it. Know what I'm doing? His lover was kidnapped. He's being blackmailed. Blackmail? Be so kind as to explain how a vampire might be blackmailed. Higher vampires? They're like us, motivated by emotions, not instinct. Not only are they intelligent to an extreme, they're emotionally rich. Capable of feeling many things, even love. 
This one fell in love with a woman, a human, and he'll do anything to keep her from harm. You do not, I trust, suggest we let Milton's killer go free, or wait until it murders again. We must render it harmless as quickly as possible. Which is why that's my aim now, to prevent further attacks. Vampires only have the problem. Blackmailers at fault chiefly. Kidnap the woman to control the vampire. And what do you propose to do? I'll find the blackmailer, free the vampire's lover. You were to destroy him, not help him. No one else should die. That's most important. As soon as the woman's safe, he'll have no more reason to kill. Hát azért a Duchess se a legélesebb kés a fiúkban. Being swayed, Witcher. You may be right. Do you know anything about the blackmailer? Got one lead. A few scraps of paper. Blackmailer wrote the names of the vampire's victims on them. One of them stained. A drop of wine looks like. So damn little to go on. You've no idea how wrong you are, my dear. Send for the Ducal Sommelier. Hop, hop! In Tucson, wine is sacred. Here there is no such thing as a drop of wine or stains therefrom. They are stains from a drop of Estest, Erveluz, Fiorano. Your Grace wished to see me. Witcher, show him the paper scrap. Benoit, can you determine which wine made this stain? Mm. Mm, yes, yes. The, the west bank of the Saint Latour. That, that, that's rather obvious. Aged in barrels of Beauclair oak. Hue, deep burgundy. Clarity, high. It's simple. Saint Real. The 1269 fit. That's, that's impossible. The wine is produced at Castel Revello. Especially and exclusively for the ducal table. Perhaps some song real was stolen. We must go to the vineyard. See if there's not been an incident. Wait. Your grace wants to go with me? Out of the question. I hope you do not suppose we will sit on our ducal hiney and do nothing while our duchy is in grave danger. Your grace, what you propose is far too dangerous. The witcher should go alone. It pleases me to see you gentlemen finally agree on something. But I've made my decision. We shall go, accompanied by the best possible escorts. You, Captain, and Geralt. We will travel incognito. We've no wish to give the court any reason to gossip. For the duration of this mission, I release you from your obligation to adhere to court protocol. In short, from now on, I am Anna Henrietta, not your grace. Yes, your grace. Yeah. Witcher, are you ready? Yeah, ready to go. Give me a moment. I must don something more appropriate and concealing. Then we will be off. Ah, izé, tudod mivel érez fel a televíziós gerinc műtéttel? Talán ahhoz fölér az év, év, év meghatározás. This vampire, have you ever faced its sort before? I have. How did it end? Did you kill it? Didn't have to fight him. Hadn't killed anyone. Get out! Why do you flee? Witcher, come back! You're to protect her highness! Have you won. ever heard of anyone defeating such a vampire? Know of a man who defeated one, sure. But he didn't manage to kill it. Ultimately, only another vampire can kill a vampire. 
Hát igen, különben újra összerakja magát. Mint ahogy Regis is. Stay back, your grace. We shall see to this. Help! Save us! Hát jó, menjünk tovább. <gül> ja, fénykardos, igen, igen, igen. Ez a Witcherhez a Star Wars mod. Nem sárkán kell eszedni, hanem egy X-winget. This vineyard, Castel Ravello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe they shot you, Maya. I guess not. Mentung. You call that escorting her illustrious highness? What were you thinking? Captain, this is not the time for such complaints. As for you, Witcher, next time keep close. Captain Delacour, we did not expect any visitors from the palace. How are affairs at court? Doubtless you've heard of the Beast of Beauclair. Well, we've our hands full. Especially since the rogue last attacked in the palace gardens. I... Trust her illustrious highness was not harmed? Kind of you to ask, Master Fabricio. I am well. Your... Your grace? We were not warned. I shall order the salon prepared at once. That won't be necessary. As you can see, we are not here on an official visit. Naturally. Might I ask then what has brought you to Castel Ravello? This is an inspection. We've got questions. You'll answer them. Oh, and who are you, sir, to speak to me this way? This is Geralt of Rivia, a witcher. He has come to Toussaint on my personal invitation. Which is to say... Which is to say I expect you to treat him with the utmost respect. Of... of course, your grace. Did you hear that, witcher? Fabricio will be delighted to answer your every question. Want to talk about San Real? At again. I am at your service. And for us, you okay, Dej? The San Real. How many vineyard workers have access to it? Again, it's been visible. Not sure what Bessie. Sure, that one is mine. Not the wine all alone. At least a dozen others work here. I see you've little notion how wine is made. Grapes travel a long road before they become Saint Real. The workers assist me only to escape confrontation. I see the maceration personally and let no one near the fat. Workers again assist me during barreling, but then I seal the aging barrels myself. Each and every one. Ugye az első rész magyar szinkronánál a szinkron színészek nem tudták hogy csak a szöveget kapták meg, nem tudták, hogy mi történik. Az életben el, el, elbaszott az egész, mert... Vicser vagyok. Na jó. De azért egy-két poénos rész ott is volt. It's a waste of time. Your Grace, how am I to understand this? 
Master Fabricio, we have proof someone's gained access to Sonreal. Someone who should not have, which means one of two things. Either you lie to our face, or you are an idiot who has had wine stolen from under his nose and not even realized it! In either case, you shall answer for it. B but Silence! And listen. I shall inspect the barrels in person, thus giving you time to reflect. When I return, I expect to hear answers. At Moyak, Ian. Remind me, where is this Onreal stored? In... in the main cellar, around the corner. I'll show you. I shall find it. Give me the key to the cellar and wait here. Oh, of course, Your Grace. Here it is. Come, Witcher. Mondjuk állítólag a magyar fordítása jobb a könyveknek, mint az angol. Bár ez sem, személy szerint sem megerősíteni, sem megcáfolni, nem tudom. What if Fabricio's blackmailing the vampire? Consider that? He has his flaws, but I would never suspect him of such a thing. He's been very loyal. He owes all he has to me. His father frittered away the family fortune. He left his son an encyclopedic knowledge of wine. Hát, az meghallgatnám. <laughs> Fabricio lived as a beggar until I appointed him steward of Castel Ravelli. Only then did he come into his own. De magyarul amúgy. Na magyarul még nem hallottam. Bármi meglepő. Én a eredeti nyelven néztem. So where do we start? Let us see if all the barrels are present. Here's the inventory ledger. Na nézzük, hogy hol az a szárjál. Fermentation completed with no complications. Tapped above sediment line. Here it is, barreling. Minden rendben ment a a fermentáció során. Lines up at first glance, neatly and thoroughly documented. Be is hordozták. Benoit said the stain came from the 1269 vintage. Let's find it. Tehát az 1269-es évjáratú szárjárt kell keresnünk. Ez Ervelus. Ez nem az. Ervelus. I like it. Quite dry. An excellent wine. Vigyünk egy kicsit. Ah, csak ne. Legalábbis ne, amikor itt van a kedves hercegnő. Ez ezt, ezt. Ezt, ezt. Think everyone and their mothers heard of this wine. Among the best in the world. Castel Ravello is famous for it. Ez meg Fiorano. Fiorano. Dandelion's favorite. Adores it. Ah, yes. That sophisticated palette of his. Hát ez egyik se az volt. Pomino. Got Pomino over here. Fő kéne menni a lépcsőn, csak attól nem látom, hogy hol van. Ja, itt van. Hmm, Szára 1270. Szára. 1270 vintage. That's the wrong year. Keep looking. Hű, majdnem leestünk. Nyem már innen. Lodó lesz. Itt nincs semmi. Itt sincs semmi. Na. Itt van a sarkunkban. Ne, ne, nehogy megcsapoljuk itt a készletet. Szárjál 1268. Szárjál. Barrels are dated 1268. Close, but not quite the right year. Megvan. Right here, 1269. What now? Let's see if any barrels are empty. Wanna open them? For now, a knock will suffice. If you hear a hollow thud, we will have found what we seek. Hmm. 
Kopogtas már, Gerált. Hát igen, óvatosan kell, mert Gerált így megrendül. Szóval mindegyik tele van. Looks like all the barrels are full. Dead end, I'm afraid. Full they are. The question is, are they full of some real? Igen. Grab a tap and a hammer. We shall open them one by one and taste. Ready. We can start. Szóval Anna Harriet most bort fog inni sokat. Ready. Step aside. Igen, nekem is ilyen gólyatábori borkostoló jutott eszembe hirtelen. Sose voltam gólyatáborban. So? Azt hiszem, legalább is nem emlékszem. Jó, tehát az rendes bor. Mármint, hogy szarjál. Nézzük ezt. Na, igye. Revolting, bitter, plonk. Szaros egri bika vérmi. Impossible. This is not wine. This is contaminated refuse that should never have made it into a barrel. The fact that it did was no accident. I'm sure. Do not imush kotai. Master Fabricio. No, a boy. Has to say about it. Ha ha ha. Ah, that's. Neo. Megvan a probléma. Master Fabricio, I am very disappointed. But your grace, I, you are a step away from losing your head. Speak the truth, and you might yet keep it. Ez a baj, para. Túl hamar meglett a. I sold a barrel of sorrel. I beg you to forgive me. Why did you do it? I couldn't resist. The sum they offered it was enormous. I gave in. Is what I provided not enough? I wished to buy back my family's estate. For here, nothing is truly mine. I've a roof over my head, ample food to eat, but. What is a nobleman without land of his own? I shall tell you everything if you agree to show me mercy. Who do you sell the wine to? A few weeks passed at the pheasantry, a rich nobleman approached me. He called himself a diplomat, well connected at court. He suggested we embark on an enterprise. Some of his clients had offered dizzying sums for even a drop of Sorreal. He was to serve as intermediary. This man's name? He never revealed it. He was tall, black-haired, and spoke with a foreign lilt. He claimed to hail from Sintra. Mm -hmm. I have no Sintri in aristocrat at court. Wine itself. How do you hand it over? We met under the cover of darkness in the ruins of Fort Astre. A dozen or so men came to collect. Armed men. The kind that stink of trouble. I had hauled the barrel there. They transferred it to their cart, and we went our separate ways. That's it? That the last you ever saw of them? They... That is to say, a, a few days passed. A, a messenger arrived. He said they wished to buy another barrel, and... Well, I've prepared it. Have it ready to deliver. 
Okay. That's enough. Know all we need to know. Your grace, I beg your forgiveness. Burton. Get out of my sight. Mash Captain, him, have your men take Master Fabrizio to the dungeon. He must answer for his crime. High treason the charge. Hát azért mondjuk a high treason az kicsit erős, de... We set a trap. Need to catch the wine thieves. Sintry and Noble could be our blackmailer. Next, transport. I'll take it to Fort Astra. Damien and his soldiers will cover me. For once, I agree with you. We will do as you say. Let me know when you are ready. Need a minute. Make haste. We await only you. Yo, it's in there. Yo, yo, okay. I'll come at you. My men stand ready. Say the word, and we will make for Fort Astra. It is time to catch these wine thieves. Chinayuk. See no reason to wait. Let's get going. We will set out now. Position ourselves before you arrive. You take the cart and meet us there. Fine. When the handoff begins, watch for my signal. You're on board. Még ekkor a bandát. Szép gyerekek. Hát igen. Azt mondja borász. Hát. Végül is. Olyas mégen. Mondjuk Korvo Bianco a miénk, szóval. És közel kellett menni, hogy rájöjjön, hogy, hogy mi a helyzet. Még jó, hogy várta a erre egyébként. <gül> jó. Kezdjük újra. Ez jó lesz, már látom. Na, csináljátok! Oké. Okay. Kicsit föl, fölrobbantunk, nem baj. Nagyon jó vagy. Hű, itt a káosz uralkodott el alapvetően. Hű. Jó, még van ugye? Uh, 
Hát nem. Ez valami más volt. Well, had no reason to trust me, and I didn't do much to change that. True, you are not the most endearing of men. <laughs> At any rate, What's I that? see the effort you put forth, and I appreciate it. Let us go to her grace. She awaits nearby. Wait, she here? I hope you did not think I would leave this to you alone, especially when every hour could prove essential. This prisoner of yours, bring him to me. We must ask him some questions. Captain, do the honors. Who sent you? You Veshirukta. His name is Dog. They say he plowed your mother. <laughs> Once again, who sent you? Your nun's lover. They call you. Wait. He doesn't wish to speak. He needs it. I can think of several other ways he can be helpful. I'm certain the Witcher will need bait to lure the beast of Beauclair. What? what? Sure can. Fresh out. In that case, he's all yours. Captain, have your men find me a strong rope. Kind that won't snap when we hang this fellow from a tree. R rope? Live bait. Great for monsters, provided they catch the scent of its blood. But I'll see to that. What? No. Crikey, no! Don't let them! Stop screaming. Save your strength. Got a long night ahead of you. No, don't let him! I I'll talk! Who hired you? He... he'll kill me! Ought to Hat. be worried about me right now. Who is he? Go on, man. Spit it out. The Sintrian. That is what they call him. I've never seen him, but I know he mustered the man for this cape. That's what they said, that we were working for the Cynthrian. I don't hmm. know anything else. I swear it. Take him away. Throw him in the dungeon. He shall await trial there. Captain, we ride to town. Gather your men and seek out the Cynthrian. Someone else must have seen him, must know of him. Yes, Your Grace. I'll report to the palace That's as soon as I learn anything. I shan't return to the palace. Everything. Our mission has not yet ended. The Witcher and I will await you at the guard post near the port. Let's go to town. What for you, Kvarni Captain? He's late. Relax, he'll come. There's something I'd like to know. How can you be so damned calm? Side effect of my mutations. We witchers rarely get the jitters. What if something has happened to him? Captain seems like a man who can take care of himself. Perhaps he can. But this Cynthrian appears to be no common bandit. He managed to steal ducal wine from under my godsman's gnosis. We only learned of it through a fortunate coincidence. And it was he who specified the victims for the vampire. One must be exceptionally confident to blackmail such a monster. Still don't know this Cintrian's behind the kidnapping and blackmail. Might have just handled the theft of the wine. 
Even if it's so, he then sold the wine to the blackmailers. As I see it, that makes him an accomplice. Need to find the Centrian, whether or not he's responsible for the murders. Even if none of it's his doing, he could still know our blackmailer's identity. Besides, it's one thing to know who ordered the killings. Other thing entirely and just as important is why they... Someone's coming. Captain, why so long? We expected you hours ago. This Centrium does not work alone. We are fighting an organization, not one man. Bandits attacked us, not a small force either. One of my boys has a broken arm, another a shattered knee, lamed for life. And the word on the street is there's a hefty bounty on your head, Geralt. <laughs> Used to it. Not the first time I've been hunted. Must you always? Now, the port warehouse where the wine was delivered, we identified it, then learned who had hired it out. This proved to be a beggar, a stand-in. We found him. He admitted all. A man had paid him to sign the lease, a man he met while begging outside the pheasantry. Mm -hmm. There, fate lent us a hand. A waitress recalled spilling wine on a nobleman who spoke with a Cintrian accent. What did he look like? Her description was not helpful. Handsome, well-dressed, with a beard. No distinguishing marks. This could be anyone. But she remembered his female companion very well, as she recognized her. On the Cintrian's arm was Cecilia Bellant. The singer? I've heard of her. She said to be gifted, fairy. The same. We went to her home immediately. Cecilia was not there, but we questioned her servants. A shame of it Cecilia is to meet a Cintrian gentleman tonight. She'd invited him to a reception mounted by the Mandragora. The Mandragora? Okay. What's that? A club. An affiliation of local artists. Painters, sculptors, troubadours and dancers. Never heard of it. They exude a... The hey, this cool. mm -hmm. Consciously, I think. Behaving like an exclusive cabal. Artistic elites. Every now and again they mount soirees. Only wealthy patrons are invited. Okay. All arrive in elaborate masks, then drink and flirt. Gotta nab the sentry. That bully bomb I didn't call We have to go to that get together. You read my mind, Witcher. I shall gather my men, surround the establishment. Not a mouse will squeeze through. Out of the question. If the Synthrian truly does have men about the city, he will find out and escape once again. Duchess is right. Need to be careful. Best go there, blend in with the crowd. Precisely what we shall do. We, your grace. Geralt and I. In that sort of company, the Witcher could use my help. Where's the event going to be held? The Mandragora always assembles at the same place. A residence in Oatville. It's a very distinguished district. Mm -hmm. Geralt, you must don appropriate attire. Then meet me in Oatville, in Mountebank Alley. Kick out his link. Hat you. Jó, tehát uh, egy ilyen abszintos kokainos buliba megyünk. Áll az égnek. Um, kéne valami normális ruha. Kezdetnek. Meg lehet meg is kéne borot... Nem, nem borot válkozok meg. Itt kell vele találkoznunk. Itt meg van a ruhás. Megyünk ruháért. Is that a witch? Szóval a vérdíj van a fejünkön, úgyhogy nagy valószínűséggel belénk fognak kötni. Na gyere! Ted!
I'm a hunted man. Yes, he has left me drunk in the gutter again. Tug. Yo. Render on. Ducal guards full of things. I want him not to drink, drink, drink. Még vihetnénk egy fél disznót is, hogy legyen mit enni. Oké. Jó. Hol a szabó? Itt a szabó. Hello. Pierre. Sacre bleu. It's a crime. You're from the north. That's painfully clear. Excuse me. There is no excuse. Munkaruhába vagyunk. There is but the need to outfit you anew. My salon stands open. Please come in. All jests aside, let me see what you got in your wardrobe. I'm more than willing, sir. Hmm. No. Bukler. Porque. Fogalmam sincs. Ez a legdrágább. Ez veszük meg. Nilf Guardian shoe. Hát az biztos, hogy nem. Oké, okay, Bókler. Igen. Megyünk maszkot is. Hát nyilván a Wolf maszket veszük. Jó, hát reméljük ez jó lesz. Szevasz. Jó. Megyük is föl. Szerintem kiváló. Tökéletes. Mehetünk. Így legalább nem ismerik fel, hogy mi vagyunk Gerált. Mikor lesz Cyberpunk? Hát, ezt szeretném én is tudni. Mikor játszuk végig? Hát, legyen úgy. Már egy 2077-ben fogok-e videójátékokkal játszani. Szóval késik. Ki gondolta volna? Meg vagyunk dicsérve, srácok. My, my, Geralt. Not bad at all. And you've even a mask. Just not the kind required. Hát, addigra már lesz 38 van igen. Már most is lehetne, csak... Még mindig kokainárba van. 
Let's go. Soirée started. Körülbelül olyan százer forint a drága, mint amire én gondolnék, hogy kéne. Majd, hogyha annyiba fog, annyi ide lehet kapni, mint amennyibe kerül, már mint hogy. Na, tehát értitek? Akkor majd veszek is. Addig meg veszek egy PlayStation. How do we find this in real? És az minden megold. He is not a spook him. Need to ask after his partner Cecilia first. Less likely to raise suspicions. As soon as we find her, we find him. Especially since he might be expecting us. What do you mean? Ran into some of his thugs in town. Knew who I was. Had it in for me. Right. Right you are. We must proceed with caution. Hát igen már, bolycsak. Tehát én olyan bruttó 3-3-20-ra gondolnék. Már az alapra. Üdvözlet, Jean. Tell us about these performances. This evening, the Mandragora has the honor to present three superb displays of artistry. The first was a concert by Cecilia Belont, a singer whose voice, were it stone, would surely be a diamond. Sadly, Mademoiselle Cecilia has sung. Shame. You would have loved to hear her. When you go out, you are in the Master of Visual Illusions. Tehát ilyen OC-s verziókat láttam ilyen 700 környékén, nem kevés, de az már szerintem úgy kezd úgy nagyjából helyén lenni, nagyjából. It cannot be easy to identify anyone in this crowd. Perhaps you could help us find her. Hát, I don't know where. Ah, Iris, nem is annyi biztos nem vennék videókártyát. Let's hear it. Seek the Kaviri orchid. Meaning. Cecilia wears one in her. Hát, játékra. You shall recognize her. Tisza. Hát igen, igen, igen. Nem nagy a különbség. Hát, van különbség az ér, de. De az már nagyon sokba kerül. Az... Tehát nem az, mert lehet, hogy ér annyit. Ezt én nem tudom megmondani. De annyit nem adnék már egy videókártyáért. Oriana. Kaviri Orchid. Let's look for it. If we find Cecilia, we'll find the Centrian. Na, hát akkor nézzünk szét. Meg azt írja, hogy vegyünk részt az este szórakoztató eseményein. Hát jó. Azt mondja, hogy félek lefürdeni. Hát kisebb dolgi is öltem már embert. Van még ilyen sárga, kék, az is kék. Ennyi? Ja, még lehet, jó van. Tehát, hogy fejezzem ki a belső művé, a bennem rejlő művészt. Nem menni akarok, hanem te menj arrébb, mert útba vagy. Komolyan mondom, én itt próbálnék művészkedni, erre itt beáll. Na, még oda dobunk egy lilát. Na, én mondjuk oda. Szerintem így jó lesz. 
Szóval sárgát is. Hát de... Hogy dobjak oda, hogyha elfogyott? Ja, itt van jó. Dobtam egy sárgát, így van. Az befolyt a sárga alá. The continual battle between good and evil, and defiance. <laughs> oh yes, that's him, all right. Good versus evil, the dualistic nature of man. And defiance. Ne jó, van valami szesz, amúgy. Um. Ah, itt van. Na, csapjunk már egyet. Vagy száraz éknál vagyunk? Abszint, így van. Na. Most már jók vagyunk. Itt mi van? Ezek mit csinálnak? Ja, kötélhúzás. <gül> Jó munka volt. Na mi van még itt? Hát szerintem majd ide kell jönni. Az abszint hat, amúgy. Hát igen. Abszint az működik. Ó. Ilyen lámpás lehet eregetni. Nem is tudom, hol volt szokás így... Hát nem szokás, vagy... Úgy esküvőken eregették a lámpást, aztán Kaliforniában ilyen erdőtüzek lettek. Tudod, mint ez a gender reveal party. Na jó. Azt elengedtük, hát reméljük, hogy nem gyújtjuk fel a társait. Jó. Na. Uh, Anna Harrietta, most már haladjunk. Hát igen, majd eldönti a felnője. Na, szóval ö, keresnünk kell egy nőt, akinek egy kubíri orhidea van a hajában, vagy valami gyomnövény. Szevasz. Nem tudom mi baja van, nem is érdekel. Hát itt nincs senki. Úgyhogy akkor valószínű nem itt van. Akkor a szembe. Jó ez az abszint. Jó, így se vagyok. Hát ez egy... 
akit keresünk. Ide meg nem lehet bejönni. Igen. Remek volt. Um, Anna Harriet, te itt... És ho hova kell, vagy... Na, itt biztos, hogy nincs. Itt sincs. Meg, itt meg végképp nincs senki. Hát erre meg nincs semmi, úgyhogy... Csak szembe van. Hát de itt sem volt semmi. Itt szomorkodott valami fickó. Lehet itt még nem voltunk. Ja. Akkor megvan. Jó, itt már megy a nagy festés. Jó lett, azt mondja. Do not disturb. Shoo, shoo. Mm-hmm. It's the right flower. Of course it is. A Kaviri orchid lends just the right contrast to her complexion. Need to talk to your model. It'll only take a minute. To me? Lie still. You may speak, but for love's sake, do not move. Wow. Impressive portrait. I know the style, the stroke. This is Dorian Villes. The gracious lady has heard of me. I, I've heard Anna Henrietta herself wished you to paint her portrait once. Ah, uh, at one point the palace chamberlain even wrote to me, but alas, ultimately refused my terms. What was the matter? When he learned I only ever paint nudes, he suffered all contact. Oh. He said he would not dare offend her illustrious highness with such a proposition. I've always longed to paint her such a shame. I think you may still get your chance. Opa. We came here to meet you, specifically. To meet me? But why? Sentry and Noble you came here with. Wanted to ask you about him. Sentry and Noble? Ah! You must think I'm Cecilia. Orchid uh, confused me. I told you not to move! As she concluded her performance, Cecilia tossed the flower into the crowd. I caught it. But I did see the nobleman. Really like to talk to him. What did he look like? Like many here. Tall, dark. Masked. Know where he might be now? He gave Cecilia a small gift. A heart-shaped box. Then they strolled off together towards the refreshment tables. Excuse me, madame. Monsieur, I cannot work like this. You must leave now. Fóly tartsd a munkát, okvetlenül. Jó. Na hát, keressük meg akkor itt a... Srácok, már haza kéne menni lassan, nem? Na, itt vannak szendvicsek elvileg. Szerelmes levél. 
Oh, my amour, my sunbeam flittering across the firmament of my life. Hát em, amúgy is már boly, már bőven elmúlt 10 óra 20 perc van nézni. Hát itt... Ah, tehát egy parfüm volt benne. Ó. Hát akkor ez nem Dandelion-nek a... Tehát miért áll bele mindig a seggembe Anna Harriet, ahogy őszintén? Tervei vannak, vagy mi? Hát ezt én se kommentelném. Na jó. Keresjük, menjünk a szag után. The right cuff seems somewhat higher to me. It's fine. Relax. Master Bubo is a... Sorry, only artists in the Mandragora allowed. Come. We must consider what to do. I'm... Calitev. Why is that voice anywhere? Hmm. You... You must be mistaking me for someone else. I served 15 years in the palace. Your Grace, I did not mistake you for anyone. Shh! Not so loud. We are here incognito. On state business. Yes, Your Grace. How may I serve? At Elisrish. I hope we can count on your discretion. Of course. I shall be silent as the grave. Looking for Cecilia Bellant, seen her? She's in her dressing room, where she went with a nobleman. They clearly were drawn to each other. They went back to the feast ticket. Tall, broad-shouldered. As though they were getting the orat. Keeping out from under his mask, and he spoke with a foreign accent, a drawl of sorts. That must be him. We must get to the dressing room quickly. Yes, Your Grace. I'll take you. No, stay here. Anyone tries to flee, you stop them. Understood. Quickly, upstairs. No, de akkor... Igen, leszületeljük itt a növényeket, az fontos. Cecilia. At this boy. No pulse. We're too late. He... He slit her throat. The brute. Hmm. Didn't go out the door. Guard would have noticed. Might still be somewhere here. You must find him before he harms another. I shall alert Oriana. At once. She should bring her soiree to a close. Shouldn't split up. Geralt, I will be fine. Go after that rogue. I shall fetch help. No. Tore down the door. Bloody handprint. Clever. It must be pretty strong too. Ezt miből gondolod? Ez 
zárva. Must have climbed this ladder. It's tempting knife. I should stay alert. Used during the fight, probably. What do you mean? Smashed mirror. Someone crashed into it hard and sank to the floor. Blood stains. Where you move, Minda? Hall. Where is it? Links of a snap chain. Jewel must have been on it. Precious stone. Bloody fingerprint on it. Thief came for this. Must have. Tiny chain links next to it. From a snapped necklace. Seems there was a struggle. Hmm. Empty inkwell, knocked over, turned toward the room. Looks valuable, but it's not what he came for. That that could not be better or what? Why did that say so? Do you have it? It keys. Locked. No key in sight. Canvas is cut. Somebody took a knife to the painting. Looks like. Oh. The sconce is bent, smeared with blood. Someone tried to grab it. Blood on the window frame. Someone climb out, fall out. Hm. Jewel was in the box. It seems. Centrian tried to steal it, but someone got in his way. They fought, struggled. That's clear. Ended with one of them flying out the window. Fall had to have killed them. Jewel's still here, though. So our Centrian must have been the flyer. So this is the tracker, a Witcher, yes. Indeed, this is him. We found the body together. Then he set off in pursuit of the killer. And ended up here. But I've only found evidence of a fight. Seems the Centrians killed his last. Finally failed this time. Shame it happened too late for Cecilia. Poor girl. Always told her she chose her males badly. But I would never have suspected she could arrive with a murderer. I'll alert the staff. Have them see to her body at once. Meanwhile, we should sit. I will tell you everything in full detail. No. Let's talk about seeing a thing. I caught him red-handed, attempting to burgle, rifling through my possessions. What did you do? Summon the guards? There was no time. I feared he'd escape, refused to give him the chance. He stood with his back to me, so I attacked. He struck his head on a picture frame as we struggled. He was bleeding, dazed, and then he drew a knife. Everything happened very quickly then. I knocked the weapon out of his hand and pushed him hard. He fell out of the window. Just so. None too wise picking a fight with an armed robber. Why? Because I'm a woman in a frock rather than plate, I can take care of myself. I assure you, a hairpin might look like mere ornament, but plunged into an eye, it can be as effective as a blade. Claim the man was trying to rob you when you walked into the room. Yes, he stood over my dressing table, pouring through my jewelry. Mm-hmm. After this is my guess. Picked it up while searching. Why? That's the heart of Toussaint. Oriana, how did you ever come to have it? Hmm. I bought it many years ago from a young woman. Jewel seems important. Why? The heart is an heirloom. It belonged to my family for years. Then it disappeared. I didn't think we would ever recover it. Seems someone is very determined to find it. 
The thief left his tool bag behind. Found this drawing inside it. Look. Tehát ezt kereste akkor. Hát inkább Tucson technőse. Talán. So, so it is not him we seek, but his employer. Is this the only evidence we found? Also happened on the weapon he attacked Oriana with. Hunting knife. Used to skin game. Got an emblem on its hilt. This crest is used by the lords of Duntime. The present master of the castle is a passionate hunter. Our next meeting, no? perhaps. Duntime. Remember the place. Abandoned ruin just a few years ago. More recently, the family's last heir. Roderick returned to his ancestral seat and restored the castle. Know any more about this Roderick? His grandfather was an advisor to Queen Ademarta. The family received those lands as a grant for his service. Roderick is quite the recluse. He avoids society, preferring the company of a small team of knights. Though the latter term is imprecise, as they seem more akin to vandals with crests on their shields. Oriana. Everything we discussed here, hope you'll keep it to yourself. Counting on it, in fact. Word gets out he, uh, failed in his attempt to steal the jewel. His employer could run. We need to proceed cautiously. Discretion is in the interest of us all. I'll not ask what this is about, just as I expect not to be troubled about it again. By anyone. <clears throat> Forgive me, Madam Oriana, but might I have a word? You must excuse me a moment. No. Oriana, any thoughts? Few make me feel awkward, but in her presence, I sense anxiety, discomfort. Idegesíti. Érthető. The drawing. It's on the same type of paper the victims' names were written on. Drawn with the same ink too. Seems the work of our blackmailers. They were not only behind the beast's murders, but also stole the Son Real and sought to steal the heart of Toussaint. Look, the wine, the jewel, both tied to you intrinsically. Coincidence? Not something I'm willing to believe. Worried about one thing. That somewhere at the end of this scheme, plan might call for an attempt on your life. It... it could be something else altogether. My sister, Siana, might be among the schemers. No. She left court when we were children. My parents banished her from the duchy. I've not seen her since. Think your sister might be involved? Why? You see, I recall her always being rather possessive. Throwing jealous fits if I had something she didn't. Here, that's normal for sisters. Rivalry. True. I suppose I gave as good as I got. There are times I miss that very much. The wine, its theft was the first clue. That's very much like her. She always did enjoy stealing my toys. But I grew almost certain when I saw the heart of Toussaint. Siana received it from father as a gift. At a time when my parents thought of her as but an ill-behaved little girl, someone wanted some of my wine. The same someone ordered our family jewels stolen, or recovered. It's my sister. It must be. A fallen princess satisfying whims, going after lost luxuries? Hmm. Could be right. What did your sister do to get banished? Siana was... cursed. Parents run afoul of some mage? No. She was born at an inopportune moment. They said she was touched by the curse of the Black Sun. Oh, into Yennefer. Is it true? Can an individual be evil because they were born during the wrong lunar phase? Could be the case. Could also be because they were treated like lepers from birth. Isolated, prodded, 
ostracized. Couldn't have had it easy, Sienna. She... She was angry at the whole world. She felt inferior, felt pain, though she masked this with confidence, arrogance even. She could also be cruel at times. I recall one such situation. She persuaded Cedric the Coolbert that she could see the future in her dreams. We were children, and Cedric's brother was smitten with me. It was an innocent childhood crush. Sianna knew of it. She told Cedric of a dream she had had, that he would die at the hands of his own brother. Cedric stole his father's sword and killed his brother. She destroyed two lives with a prank. Cedric mourns to this day. In the end, they forced her to leave the palace. A decade passed. More. I've missed her terribly since. Hmm. Your mission has gained new import. You must go to Dun Tyne, and if Sianna is there, you must find her. No matter what she did, she is not to be harmed in any way, shape or form. You must make sure of that. Okay. Nem esett baja. I'll find her if she's there. I hope you do. I very much wish to talk to her, sister to sister. Your Grace, Geralt, I'd like to introduce Regis. No. What a surprise! I had no idea you were in Beauclair, and this is uh, my very dear friend Declaf van der Eretane, um. arrival from Nazaire. We are lending our combined resources to the witch's hunt. Okay. Ah, uh, yes. Splendid. But why are you here at Oriana's? They came to pay me a surprise visit, so I invited Regis in for a glass of wine. We've known each other for... Ooh, ages. Literally. Witcher, I hear you know Regis too. Even that you are friends. Few I can rely on like I can on Regis. Kind of hoping he thinks the same of me. Curious. It seems opposites really do attract. Don't be fooled, dear. Geralt has many merits. He merely hides them from the world very diligently. Mm -hmm. You said you're both aiding him with his contract. It involves the Beast of Beauclair, I suspect. Master Witcher, maybe you could satisfy my curiosity. What's it like going toe to toe with a monster, knowing you've only two options, to kill or be killed? Despite what you might have heard, I don't lunge at every monster I see, sword in hand. Talking gets the job done for some. Hmm. I wonder what a monster might have to say to you. It might want to apologize. My word. For what might the monster wish to apologize to a witcher? For killing. Though at times there is no choice. When loved ones are at risk and require protection. Same as humans. Put them in that situation, they'll kill too. You understand this. It must be why you and Regis are friends. If I understand you correctly, you would rather help a monster than kill it. If possible, yeah. Or at least try. Enough about the Witcher trait for now. Regis mentioned you come from Nazaire. I spent time there as a child. Fond memories? It was wonderful. I was positively entranced by the land's fashions. Deep cut dresses I found most fascinating. I believe we're running short on wine. I should go to the cellar, bring another bottle. Let me go. Want to help Regis? Know your wine a lot better than I know mine. We shall return forthwith. An exceptional conversation, don't you think? Vampires, a witcher, and the Duchess of Toussaint? My, my. Highly exceptional, Regis. Wanted to talk to you in private. You crazy bringing Detloff here? Geralt, uh, allow me to explain. No, let me explain. He's dangerous, and you are gonna watch him. But that is precisely what I'm doing. Detloff believes you'll succeed in your task, and he'll not need to kill anymore. 
That is, not until he gets his hands on the men who kidnapped his Renner. Oriana, is she really your friend? Can she be trusted? I met her years ago, before I met you, and before she settled in Beauclair. We'd not seen one another in... Uh, oh, I, I can't begin to tell you in how long. But I shall tell you all about her some other day. Guessing it's no accident you two stopped by. It would be quite some coincidence indeed. No, a dutiful little bird told us. Mm-hmm. Now listen close. Manage to learn where the blackmailers are. They're based at Duntine Castle. That's splendid news. If they are there, Renna must be there as well. Duchess expects we'll find her long-lost sister there too. Thing is, she might be involved. Could be behind the blackmailing. Do you mean to say your task now is to extract two women from the castle? Mean to say we can't breathe a word of this to Dedloff, who wants revenge above all else. Geralt. You must trust me. I've got away with... No, Regis. Can't risk it. Gotta keep Dedloff here while I go to Duntime. Alone? Alone. That way I can make sure neither woman will come to any harm. I hope you know what you're doing. Fine. I shall see to Dedloff. Good luck, my friend. Okay. Splendidly, Dedloff. Ah, oh, I'm grateful you brought back those memories. You're back. It took you long enough. Contrary to what common folk believe, choosing a wine is not nearly as easy as it might seem. As each one. Especially a wine to be served to two exquisite ladies. Mindig a felső polcról kell választani. As ever. I regret all the more that I shan't finish this second bottle with you. Duty calls. Your grace, always a pleasure. I thank you for your help. It's been invaluable. Geralt, will you see me out? Hazaig. Vagy mi? Fú, ez a jelenet nagyon durva egyébként. Szerintem az egyik legjobb jelenet az egész játékban. Már ami nem ilyen harc vagy ilyesmi. This Detlef. An intriguing man, to say the least. Don't know him too well. He say much about himself? Not much, but I've a good sense of the true nature of those I meet. I'd not survive for a week at court otherwise. So what's his? Sensitive, sad. He carries within him the weight of a terrible tragedy. He is a good man, but lost, oh. which is why he comes across as grim. <laughs> Didn't expect the evening to end like this. Neither did I. But I have not drawn you out for a romantic stroll. I wish to make certain you know what you are to do. Mm -hmm. Gotta go to Duntine. I've decided my guardsmen will support you. You will meet them at Count de la Croix's mill. I know the place. Captain de la Tour and his men will await you there at midnight. You shall storm the castle together. Értettem, főnök asszony. Na, ez egy kiváló, kiváló jelenet. Jó. Oké, és na. Még mielőtt... Uh, még mielőtt mennénk... Uh, ez is akartam. Visszaveszük a ruhánkat, nyilván. Elmegyünk a kovácshoz, megjavítatjuk. Aztán hazaugrunk aludni. Csak hogy legyen egy kis buff. És utána megyünk. Hát nem nagyon van mit aludni. Úgyhogy csak megjavítjuk ezeket. És már itt se vagyunk. Good luck on the path. Amúgy is egész éjszaka buli volt. Úgyhogy most hazamegyünk alukálni. 
éjfél után kell találkozni a fickóval. Ó, és százas szintűek vagyunk. Na, szuper. Tesszük ezeket a vackokat. Ne legyen nálunk fölöslegesen. Na, és akkor most alszunk egyet. Ugye ide, ide megyünk a szomszédba amúgy. Tehát nem messzire. Ez is hajnalban hazatámoljunk, alszunk egész nap. Kicsit föltárazunk pósönökkel is. Jó. És teszünk buffot a kardra is, meg a páncélra. Na, és akkor mehetünk. De nyilván lóháton. Hát így nyomunk egy nagy mentést is. Csak még most beindul a, beindulnak a történések. Ahogy mondja is. Hát akkor fel is dobja nekünk. Jó. Na mi a helyzet itt? Geralt, good you're here. Ready to attack Duntine? Csináljuk. See you already prepared a plan. Walk me through it. We have two objectives. To find her illustrious highness's sister and capture the man who blackmailed the vampire. Duntine is a modest complex. Several old buildings, a high wall around them. At the center of the enclosure stands an imposing keep, restored not long past by the elderly knight of the castle, Roderick. We mean to strike here, through the main gate, then secure the area in front of the keep by storm. How many men defend Duntine, you know? Roderick maintains a team of knights for defense. They are no army, but they could number several dozen. Also, Roderick recently took in a band of foreign mercenaries. About them we know very little. Sintrian's men, gotta be. Ran into a few in town. They tried to kill me. Need to hit them from both sides. You draw the defenders, keep them busy. I'll sneak in the back way, find the women, make sure they come to no harm. I'll vault over the wall as soon as you start your assault. Your plan puts you at great risk. But I sense you will handle it well. Let us go. Regisnek valami haverja volt biztos. So it begins. Quick, we grab Roderick's horses and we bolt. We won't vault far if the boys out front don't hold. Not so fast. Little change of plans. Any last words? 
Jól kezdődik. Rávertem egy nagyot, de nem nagyon vette, vette fel, tehát így. He's looking to flee. Can't let him. I see no ducals along the road. They must not be guarding it. Fast, brother! Lose the straight flee. We'll manage. Hurry with those crates. They've breached the back wall. Come on! If you drop, kill him. Go on, lads. Beat the bum butcher. Jaj, bocsánat. Surround him! Surround and kill! Jaj. Kellett itt vagánykodnod. Someone with them, woman named Sienna. Of, of course, she, she convinced me to let them in. And a whole pile of trouble along with them. Where is she? Did it one Sienna? Pack, packing. Chumagul. We were to leave together, and old fool, I'd have done anything for her. Where is she? In the keep too? It, yes, her chamber is in the tower. Top floor. What? What will become of me? Hmm. Here, press it against the wound. Should staunch the bleeding. I, I thank you. 
Jó. Nyerünk tovább. Ő mekkora egy állat vagy te. Az igen. Hűha. Hát de ha az animáció után nem tudok eldodzsolni, akkor mi a baj f... csináljak? Már bocsánat. Ú, de utálom az ilyet, hogy beadja az animációt, hogy kivégzi, oké. Okay. De akkor ne tudjon már megütni. Borg. Okay. Oh. Giving you one last chance. Yield. got us into this. Kill him. Attack. Ah, megjöttek a vámpír barátai. Ah, és megint jön majd a dilemma, hogy meg kell ölni Deathlafot. Érted egy random bandit a paraszt, így fog egy bunkós botot, azt nagyon ver egy vicsert. Jó, én játszom Death march persze. De nem attól lesz nehéz egy játék, hogy vánsatolnak. Vá Yeah. 
Alapvetően közösen fort volt, mert egyet-egyet én is ütöttem. Na itt van akkor Rena is, meg Sienna is. Oh. Na szedd össze magad, mert úgy nézel ki, mint a fosabb. Kösz. Mit néztek? Now we need only find Anna Henrietta's sister. Where should we look? Do you know? Mm -hmm. Ran into Roderick, Duntine's lord. Told me where I'd find Sienna. Then speak and let's grab her. Time is short. Said she was in a room in the tower, the very one we're in right now, which incidentally looks nothing like a prison cell. Hmm. And just so happens there's a carafe full of wine here. Bet it's stolen Saint Real. What's your point? Stop playing dumb. I know everything. Your plan, that this was part of it. Witcher, what is this? Sorry, Deadlaff. You've been had. Atlet, my friend, please. Verve. You must listen to what Geralt has to say. Rena's not her real name. This is Siana, and Siana is sister to Anna Henrietta, the Duchess of Toussaint. What? What nonsense is this? Siana was banished as a child, but it seems she trekked back here recently, moved into Duntine, and ran a Vandergild out of here. Sent a man called the Cintrian to Beauclair to steal some wine for her, wine reserved for the ducal family. Cintrian led us to her. Caught him later stealing a jewel Sian had gotten from her father as a child. <clears throat> Sorry, Deadloff. She used you. Part of her plan. Hmm. Semmit nem tudnál tenni. You will come to Teshamudna and explain all. If you do not, I will raise Beauclair to the ground. This I promise you. You've three days. I shall be waiting. Három nap. He just fly off. He did not wish to act rashly. He's gone to soothe his nerves. Think he'll do it? Make good on his threat. I cannot say. He can be unpredictable when fury consumes him. I shall go to him. Come again? After what he just... You don't know Detlaf like I do. If I don't do as he says, he truly will destroy the city. He's more than capable of it. Seems you've got some last scraps of honor left. It's the least I can do. Well, it truly does seem the best option. Your Grace, we must hmm. proceed with caution. Guardsmen saw vampires here. They could still be about. Vampires or no vampires, my sister is here. Chucky Megyland. Your Grace, that.
Sianna, it's true. It's you. Sister, dear, what have you gotten yourself into? So concerned, I'm surprised. Is there an ounce of truth to it? You... You feel resentment. I understand. But I promise, promise we shall work through all the unfortunate matters of the past. We will discuss them later. Captain, escort Sianna to the palace. I shall meet with her as soon as we return. As you wish, Your Grace. <clears throat> and you, Witcher. You have my thanks. I cannot believe my sister was so near the whole time. Roderick of Duntine shall answer for treason and blackmail. Roderick got duped and used, just like the vampire. Apropos, were you able to establish who kidnapped his beloved? We've discovered Siana blackmailed the vampire, ordered him to kill those men. What? Mm. What nonsense is this? She is his missing lover, staged her own abduction to force him to do her bidding. He was a tool. The whole scheme was Siana's. She was behind it. You're mistaken. You must be. This cannot be true. Your Grace, I know this vampire and... What? You know him? Who is he? <laughs> Detmarf. Srácok, nagy szarba vagytok. Same who so recently sat at my table and told me of Nazar. Is there anything else you've neglected to mention? A dragon living beneath Mount Gorgon, perhaps? Is anyone else here a vampire? Um. <laughs> Again, this is a piece that I couldn't have said with Shami and Dani. Waiting for Siana. If she doesn't show up to meet him by an appointed time, he'll destroy Beauclair. He dares threaten us. Your Grace, we have three days to bring him Siana, and not a word. You have three days. To bring me his head. No more secrets. No more helping vampires. I want what I'm paying for. The head of the beast. Ez most meg lehet mondva. Do you think her grace's nerves have been calmed? Doubt it. Rarely forgets, rarely retracts what she says, especially not threats. Yes, well, even I must admit Detlaf's actions were highly inappropriate. Reprehensible, even. Are you upset? Why would I be? Hmm, let's see. You're returning from your hunt empty-handed. No trophy. No new lead to boast of, then pursue. What can I say? It happens at times. Especially likely to when the monster I'm chasing can turn into fog. How do your employers customarily react when you fail to meet their expectations? <sighs> it depends. Peasants cuss me out. Merchants demand I refund their deposit. Whereas nobles mostly just release their hounds. And rulers? Usually threaten me with the gallows. A most illustrious grace awaits the gentleman. Grace, the population demands she be punished. Siona's committed terrible crimes, spilt so much blood, they... Another word, Palmerin, and I shall spill even more blood. Yours. Oh, <laughs> Csak ilyen óvatosan én se finoman. Repeat for the last time. Siona is responsible for the death of many, true. But she is also my sister. We are bound by blood and by a shared childhood. I shall not allow her to be lynched. Your Grace, I fear the masses might rise. Storm the prison, pitchforks and torches in hand. Let them storm. They will not find her there. Siana is hidden away in a safe place. She shall await trial there until we have rid ourselves of this accursed vampire. 
which to judge by your means has not yet come to pass. Did what we could, but... My patience is at an end, Gerov. Where is he? Where is Detlaf? Don't know. I lost his trail. Is this all you have to say? I respect your grace. All I can say is the truth. Ah. At times, I hunt foxes. Do you know how it works? The Ducal Huntsman releases the hounds. They catch the fox's scent, chase the animal down, and lead the Bachu to it. All within an hour. You, Witcher, have had a week. The aid of my most excellent knights. Yet, you have tracked absolutely nothing down. I've begun to suspect my beagles might have done a better job. Then perhaps your grace should have sent a beagle instead of a witcher after the vampire. Muszáj volt, nem hagyhattam ki. You tread on thin ice, Witcher. Very thin. Wisdom demands you choose your words more cautiously. But to the matter at hand. Have you managed to establish anything? Your Grace, it seems Siana tricked Detlaf. Used him to murder the knights who escorted her into exile. We have reason to believe that... Indula Bully. Your Grace! Vampires! What? Speak now! Vampires! They protect the city! Kept them the Lator defense to square near the boat landing. But so many lives lost. Damn it. It's war this Detlef wants. It's war he shall have. Geralt, get to work. This time I'll hear no excuses. Palmer and you. Too. Oh, bad. Get her out of here.
Okay. Siana failed to appear as summoned. And there. Detloff is not making idle threats. Seems not. Just need to make some serious plans of our own now. It's gone too far, damn it. Regis, you mentioned there was a way to draw Detloff out. A way you've avoided resorting to so far because you thought it was too dangerous. Is that how I put it? Do forgive me, but I've misled you terribly. The word dangerous is simply a scandalous understatement in this case. Regis, another inner monologue growing out of a personal dilemma. Just tell me how to flush Detloff out, force him to meet, please. No. In due course. Uh, but first, ending. Geralt, I'd like you to consider the alternative. After all, you could fulfill Detloff's demand and liberate his beloved Sion. Think Detloff still believes Sion is innocent? I believe he suspects something. He must. And he seeks to understand what happened. And for that, he's declared war on the entire duchy? What can I say? Moderation was never his strong suit. Atkus. Really want to free Siana? Hand her over to Dedloff? Refuse to accept you consider that wise. It's hard to believe, I know. But Dedloff is not actually evil, merely impulsive. He needs but meet with her, speak with her, and he will spare the city. Hmm. So say I agree to this, because I might. Still no chance Anna Henrietta will. I do not recall ever suggesting we ask her permission. Hmm. The meeting. What if it's nothing like you say? What if it goes sour, ends in a fight? Willing to guarantee Siana won't get hurt? It seems unlikely in the extreme that... Didn't ask for a lecture on probability. Need a simple answer. Yes or no. I vow that not a hair on her head shall come to any harm. Got serious reservations about this plan. Not least among them, we have no idea where Siana's being held. You heard the Duchess. She's not at the prison. Hardly a reservation. More of an excuse. I'm certain you'll find her. You must merely decide you wish to. Hmm. Could ask Damien. Duchess treats him like a lapdog. Keeps him close most times. He might know something more. There, you see? I knew you'd think of something. Bravo. I trust I've dispelled your doubts, then. Not so fast. We're not done talking. How would I go about luring Detloff out of hiding if I wanted to? With the blood of a virgin? You see, somewhere nearby lives an unusual denizen. One of the unseen, ancient and powerful vampires. Among the oldest and strongest. Mm hmm and? Tusa is this unseen elder's territory. All vampires owe him fealty while they are here. He need but say the word, designate a time and place, and Detlaf will be forced to appear. Mm. So this unseen elder, how do we convince him to summon Detlaf? We must find him first. The elder does not see arrivals unless he absolutely must. But locals, Oriana, for instance, you know, she too is a... Yeah, figured it out. All right, let's say she gets me in to see the unseen elder. What then? I don't know. You'll have to improvise, I suppose. Na és akkor mi legyen? So I'm basically stuck. Either gotta give in to a blackmailer or fight him. You know what I would opt for? Should we free Siana and arrange for her to meet with Detlaf? There's a good chance we'll all survive this ordeal. Detlaf included. Regis, don't mean to put you on the spot, but I gotta know. Say I do decide to fight Detlaf. Who will you stand with? Should you decide your sword is the sole solution, I shall not stand in your way. Appreciate it. Certainly hope so. Now, please tell me, what is it you intend to do? When you can have most there doing tenning. Had the meme No idea. Need to think. Not an easy choice, understood. Permit me to leave you to wrestle with this dilemma. I'm needed in the city. I cannot stop what is happening, but I can try to limit the number of victims. Once you've decided and learned something, perhaps, whisper a word to the ravens. I shall find you. Okay. Yo, hát megnézzük ezt az Orianás fonalat. Elindulunk rajta. De valószínű más, hogy fogunk dönteni. 
Szerintem Sionát kéne inkább megmenteni. Hála az égnek nem kellett meditálni. Úgyhogy... Elugrunk Orianához. Át a városon. Ami most olyan teljesen nyugis. De miért erre kell jönnünk? A srácok vajon mit csinálnak? Lehet edzenek. Mondom a fast le van tiltva. Így van. Nem véletlenül. Teszünk egy kis... Egy kis okosságot. Mert jó fog jönni. Valamiért ilyen, nem tudom miért, de jó nagyot kerültem, hát mindegy. Na, hát indul a buli, úgyhogy... Na azt a másikat, Gerált. Szét van és minden. Gyere hát így elteszi a kardot. Minek? Az igen. Oké. Mi a jó?
Hát majdnem fagyos lett. Jó. Armor proved useless. Claws slice through steel like through butter. They broke formation. Ran. Hát menekültek. Féltek. Get them on Sikerült megmérgezni ezzel a Black Blood-dal. Na hol vagy? In a hurry to get somewhere. Very much so. Now be kind enough to step aside. Chaos in the city. Know what's going on? Naturally, it's rather irritating. Bloodbath in the streets. That's irritating. I'd probably use a stronger term. Well, you know, I'm getting on in years. Not easily impressed. Takes a bit more to get me worked up. Yeah, I suppose empathy's not something I associate with vampires. I suspected you would guess. Wasn't hard. Not like you tried hard to hide it. Should I have? Well, I am a witcher. And thus my foe? That depends entirely on you. Need to uh, see your unseen. Convince him to stop Deadlove. Or you could help me with that. Oh. My, my. It seems my dear Regis needs to be reprimanded. He's become rather indiscreet. And you. There are simpler ways to commit suicide. A number of bridges you could jump off, for instance. Just want to talk to him. <laughs> talk. Lovely. He'll rend your head from your neck. Make shreds of you before you can open your mouth. Let me worry about that. Willing to do it or not? Hmm. I, too, would prefer a city calmed. But to reveal so dear a secret to a witcher. Know what? Come with me. I must tend to a certain matter. Then we'll talk. 
If you. I was talking to a human now, I'd say that every moment we delay brings another death. Thing is, doubt that moves you at all. Frankly, not in the least. Where are we going? Not far. You see, I maintain a kind of shelter just outside Beauclair. An orphanage, to be precise. Whisper. They claim a terrible things happened there. Under the present circumstances, I must treat this seriously. I'm sure you understand. Mm -hmm. Perfectly. Let's go. <laughs> Na lássuk, hova megyünk. Valami árvaház. Az együttérzés árvaház. Ez a neve. Ez a small fortune maintaining this place. What can I do? I have a weakness for children. Meaning? Meaning that I... Wait. Smell that. Blood. Hmm. Arno! 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 What happened? Where's Arno? Speak! Shh! Oh, the, the, the mon monster will come. Easy, little man. You're safe now. Vajon mi történik? I was so scared. So, so scared. Of what? You can tell us. Take your time. I, I woke up because of the bells. Then the screams. I pulled the quilt over my head so I wouldn't hear. But they were so loud. And something began pounding on the roof. Boom, boom, louder and louder. Then Oki Arno came and said, sit quiet, real quiet, shh, shh, and you'll be all right. The whole son abandoned them, left them and ran away. What happened then? Bartes, Neve, Mora, and some others, they ran out. My sister Anna and me, we hid right here in the room. But Anna, she began to cry. I covered her mouth, whispered, shh, 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 held her long, till she stopped. You mean to say you... Drop it. Who's this Arno? The Guardian. He ran the orphanage with his wife, for a generous fee. I don't see them, can't hear or smell them either. They fled, left the children behind as bait. Uncle Arno told us to be quiet as mice, and the monster wouldn't come, but it did. He came. Think I know enough. As do I. Something killed my children. I'll stay with the boy. He shouldn't be left alone again. You, you track down this scum. Bring me its head, and I'll help you with the unseen. Fine. See if I can't find a lead. Excellent. Go on, get to work. Come, little one. I'll sing to you. Wolves asleep amidst the trees, but all are swaying in the breeze. But when soul lies anxious, wide awake, fearing all manner of ghouls, hags, and wraiths.
Okay. Na nézzünk szét. A hideg királyz ettől a zenétől egyébként. Hú, hogy hát daltól pontosabban. Jó. Valami szörn. Grab its attention. Claw marks. Sharp hooked claws. Monster had an easy time climbing on the roof. Paw prints. Bipedal beast. Walks hunched over. Okay. Smells not blood. Need to investigate. Gunk. Is that venom? Hmm. Arrows the list of suspects. Venom glands, long claws, a bloodsucker. Must be a Garcane, a pack leader, an alpha. The Garcane's killing's a pleasure. Kids just wet its appetite. Must have gone after the guardians too. Okay. Hát kövessük a nyomukat. Garcane and wagon tracks merge. Wonder if the beast caught up. Roach. Rócs okosan bejött ide a... Ja, mert zabál, hát nyilván. Na jó. Kövessük akkor a nyomokat. Drove off the road. Horses must have gotten spooked. Megjöttek a lovak. Suffer long. Shredded her, then licked up her blood. Every last drop. God can't eat its fill here. Probably hold up nearby to digest. Hmm. Na nézzük már meg itt, hogy a ezek az alfa garkének még, melyet kéri, hogy olvasjuk el. Hát jó. Ripper, az fontos. Ja, a hang onnan jön. Ott is van. Oké. Okay. Szevasz.
Megvan a trofi. Vissza Orianához. Tehát elmondjuk, hogy mi történt. Emerre. Igen, erre. Me off. Ariana. Release him now. I thought it would take you longer. It will. Still not done. Got one more thing to tend to. You. The orphanage. Your wine cellar, right? A larder for blood. No, Basky. I never said I helped these children out of the kindness of my heart. Go outside, little man, and lock the door behind you. No, don't hurt her. Lady Oriana took care of us. She took us off the street, brought us sweets, sang to us. Leave her be. You see, Witcher? The world's not black and white, it's shades of all kinds. I drank from the children, true, but never so much as to kill. And I gave them a great deal in return. I run into dilemmas all the time. Situations where it's hard to judge, hard to know what's right, make a decision. This is not one of them. You disgust me. And deserve to die. But I'm in a hurry, and you're hiding behind a child. So you'll live this time. I'm letting you. Did what you asked. Children slaughters the work of a Garcane, one of those summoned by Dedlaf. Probably supposed to attack the city. Children sent lured it here. Yes, it carries quite away. Its sweetness teases the nose. Gets the mouth watering. Unseen elder, where'll I find him? Talk. His lair lies west of the city, across the lake. Look for a cave near the shoreline, and this stone will open a hidden door. Not gonna take me there? I visit the elder only when I absolutely must. You'll know why once you meet him. I'll come back for you one day. You realize that, right? Hmm. Then I shall keep an eye out for you. Time to summon Regis. Slip a word to the birds, he said. Hát igen, srácok, semmi sem fekete vagy fehér. Leszünk a madarakkal. Az mindig jó. So, I'll be at the boat landing near the palace, waiting for Regis there. Mind telling him? Please, esetleg. Jó, kösz.
in the whole light ages. You've met with Oriana. How did it go? Not well. Oh. Did she not divulge where you might find the Unseen? No, she did. Also divulged her hunger for the blood of small children. Well, I admit I'd heard rumors, but... ...preferred to lend them no credence. Rather not talk about it. Caves west of town, other side of the lake. That's where we need to go. I see. Well, I'm prepared to set out at any time, but... Yeah, I know. You'd still prefer to free Sienna, for Dedloff's sake. For the sake of you both. Oh, please. Orphanage, what happened there? His fault, plain and simple. City gutters are overflowing with blood? That's his doing, too. And you're worried somebody might have hurt his feelings? To meet the Unseen Elder is to face mortal danger. I've said so all along and never in jest. You are a friend. A dear friend. I'd rather you not risk your neck unnecessarily. I think it's natural. I think it's obvious. Obviously natural. Especially when we've an alternative. An entirely reasonable one. Hát igaz. Úgyhogy ezen a vonalon is fogunk tovább menni, amit uh, kedves Regis barátunk javasol. Ah, uh, fine. Have it your way. We'll free Sienna. If we can even figure out where she's being held, because... I've looked into it already. Oh yeah? Mm-hmm. I managed to convince Damon to help us. But don't see any Damien now. A playroom? For is children? children? What did the Duchess do? Lock her in a dollhouse? Perhaps, I don't know. We must see for ourselves. Come. Yeah, the playrooms beyond this door. Okay. Viszont... Ezt nem ma fogjuk már megnézni, mert kezd későre járni az idő. Um, hanem mindenképp fogjuk majd folytatni. Vasárnap. Um, reményeim szerint. Jó, úgyhogy innen fogjuk folytatni. Um, mert tényleg... Hát még azért sok van hátra. Főleg ha rajta múlik. <gül> úgyhogy... Um, Ma itt megállunk, de szerintem vasárnap mindenképp folytatjuk. Jó, rendben van. Na, úgyhogy én elköszönök. Köszönöm a followokat, csireket, szubokat, donéteket. Legfőképpen az, hogy itt voltatok és néztétek. Üm, legközelebb stream holnap este lesz, folytatjuk a programozást, illetve lesz csütörtökön, ha jól emlékszem. De majd meglátjuk. A heti program egyébként Discordon e, szokott módon elérhető. Jó, úgyhogy még egyszer nagyon szépen köszönöm, hogy itt voltatok. E, legyen további szép estetek és szép estétek, és legyen kellemes hetetek. Na szevasztok!